God shall send forth his mercy and his truth. My soul is among lions, and I lie even among them that are set on fire, even the sons of men whose teeth are spears and arrows, and their tongue a sharp sword. Be thou exalted, O God, above the heavens. Let thy glory be above all the earth. Shalom. This truth is in the matrix. And I say this because it's vexing and you know with that facts would be in the case and you can be and you can fall out. You can become entangled. You can come become ensnared. You can you can be taken. You can be deceived because of that. So the truth is that's the reason I say the truth is in the matrix. All right, but that's what I'll be touching on. And uh, before I get into this call, hello, I'm like Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai Wahah Dash. Double honest to the whole like elder apostles. And elder bishops at the Great Millstone Church. Shalom to all the Akim out here under the same doctrine, doing what they need to do in order according to the scriptures to the best of their ability across the four corners of the globe, nonetheless. And you know, and regardless, and to the rest of you believers and on this faith as well. Of Yahweh Bashmi Al Shai. So, yeah. Coming back at you with another lesson. And. In this lesson, I just want you to focus on and understand, like I need to myself and, you know, I've been doing and realizing more and more is the truth is in the matrix. And what I mean by the matrix, the world, you know, so you heard the scriptures you know, it's a passage from Psalms, the 57th chapter, and I'll read it again. And, you know, explain, go into it, and go, go, go from there. So, as I said, by the matrix, you know, I mean the world. Obviously, for those that have uh, seen the, the movie The Matrix, you understand. Um, my reference point pretty much but this is psalms 57 and i'm gonna start at verse three he shall send from heaven right the lord send what he sent this word all right tells us that isaiah 9 and 8 the lord sent a word into jacob and it had lighted upon israel right and this word it's obviously enlighten. It enlightens us. All right. This word it enlightens us. Um, it pretty much put us on game, woke us up to the fact of who we are and the world we're actually amongst. You know, we've been we've been illuminated. All right. That's what this word did, you know did. All right. Scriptures talk about that uh, all throughout. All right, in fact, let me grab that in the book of Baruch really quick. I don't wanna go too far off, but just to prove that. All right, Baruch four and one. I'm gonna actually start it up. Now I'm gonna start at one. It says, this is the book of the commandments of the Most High and the law that endureth forever. So even off of that stance, it's, it's factually true that the, this truth, right, which is what? What's the truth? This is St. John 17 and 17. Sanctify them through thy word, through thy truth, through thy truth. Thy word is truth, right, which is what? Where is the Lord's word at? In the book, the Bible. All right, that's why our scriptures tell us to seek ye out of the book of the Lord and read 
right? Within book, within that book are the words, the will of the Heavenly Father, the, the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding, ultimately bringing complete enlightenment. And just off of that, okay, if it's the Bible, the Bible in the world, you got to go amongst the world to get this truth, to ultimately get the Bible, you know, ultimately the word, this truth, the truth. All right, so that proves it right there. So when we go to back to uh, St. John, and when you jump up to, to prove that, all right, so that's that, you know, I'm gonna uh, actually hold that, I'm gonna come back to that, all right, to prove this. So I don't want to jump ahead. So we're talking about the illumination really quick. So anyway, Baruch 4 and 1. This book, this is the book of the commandments of the Most High and the law that endures forever. All they that keep it shall come to life. But you got to first what? You got to seek it. That's why I seek you out of the book of the Lord. You got to get the book. You got to get a Bible. So you got to go amongst the world. Just off of that, right? And uh, uh, you're going to do so because... Or consider such because this book is the book that's going to enlighten us do these things it says and the law that endure forever all they that keep it shall come to life see that but such as leave it shall die turn thee this the point of jacob and take hold of it see and take hold of it you got to get it first walk in the presence of the light thereof that thou mayest be illuminated and this is Hebrews 10 and 32. It says, but call ye, you know what, let me actually get this. I'm gonna get this one instead. Sirach 25 and 11. But the love of the Lord passeth all things for illumination. See that? The ultimate enlightenment, waking up. All right, the, the true red pill, if you will, it says, you know, he that holdeth it, where to shall he be liking? So we're above uh, any 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 form of uh, man approved education, because most men don't approve the true education of of the Bible. The majority, you know, the scriptures talk about the the uh, the princes of this world. You know, the, fool, the wisdom of the princes of this world is pretty much foolishness, you know, roughly paraphrasing. All right. Um, and whatnot. So that's that. Now, going back to the point, this is uh, what the Lord sent. Right. He sent the word and it had light in upon Israel. It enlightened us. It woke us up to all of these facts. You know? That what? We uh, uh, walk in a parable, overthrow all these different things. Right? And I'm going to get one more. This is Psalms 100. Because this, the, the, this is the, like, the dilemma, it's like a dilemma once you realize the truth is among, amongst the, um, the, the, the matrix. It's in the it's in the matrix. The truth is in the matrix. It becomes a dilemma. You become you feel torn. You should feel torn in a sense once you realize this, which is why where we where um I'm coming from. So it's not that I'm all over the place or confused on what I want to say. This is really the spirit of this understanding. Right? This is what you ought to realize. Like when, when Neo and them went into the matrix, they was they was paranoid. Like, if you will, paranormal. Why? Because they walk in the peril they overthrowing. You know, but and why they in the matrix in the first place? Because the truth there. So, what, what, how, you know, which would be for us just a, an example of us and what we go into the matrix for, which is this truth and, you know, to the, to the, the, the dangers and to a certain extent. For reasoning, for the reasoning of what the truth holds, 
which is just you know is is as illumination and more which i'll read right here this is psalms 107 and 20. he sent his word and healed them and delivered them from their destructions see that so this word also is healing is medicine all right so this is why it's important to get this all right this is what this 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 truth holds for us now when you go back to psalms 100 it's like in verse uh chapter 57 and verse 3 he shall send from heaven he shall send send from heaven right he ultimately what you know he shall send from heaven because all these things let me say this too all these things is is, is a heavenly gift it's a gift this is divine intervention you know this the this is the divine intervention that we have received you know the the spirit the holy spirit the comforter you know this word which is like an unto armor medicine you know it helps a you know a, a scepter you know a crown or you know all of this man in a sense but on a, on a base on the base level like i said the the medicine and, and enlightenment in the in the in the in the um the armor you know the spiritual uh bullets to stay in the war you know to shoot back at the enemy if you will all right as we said so that was divine intervention because we was, we was down bad. All right. It says, and save me. He shall send, send from heaven and save me from the reproach of him that would swallow me up. Salah. This is the point. God, the most high, Yahweh, Basham Yahushua, shall send forth his mercy and his truth. See that? That's what he ultimately sent forth. Mercy. That's the vote. That's mercy. And ultimately, it's mercy because it's of the truth. You know, the mercy is gotten through the truth. You get the mercy through having the truth of Yahweh Bashmi Al Shah. You know, so you gotta enter where? In order to get it. Wherever is that? And where is that at? St. John 17 and 17. I'm gonna start at verse 14. I have given them thy word, and the world hath hated them. See that? Because they are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. I pray not that thou shouldest take them out of the world, but that thou shouldest keep them from evil. So pretty much we have to, we have to enter this world in order to get this truth that's what the that's what it, that's what the truth is at all right in order to receive that mercy we have to get the truth and in order to get the truth we got to what going to going to the world the matrix you know his youtube right it says and what not it says i pray not that thou shouldest take them out of the world which is why it says that but that thou shouldest keep them from the evil so pretty much you have to always enter back back and forth in and out of the matrix to get this truth right to be on this truth whether if you're teaching you got to go on the youtube upload a video or whatever the internet you know and that's what makes it dangerous because that's the matrix and if you know the movie, The Matrix is dangerous. The Matrix is just the world. The world is dangerous. All right? This world is is, is, is death. It says, that's why it says that. Yahweh I said that. I pray not that thou shouldest take them out of the world, but that thou shouldest keep them from evil. They are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. Sanctify them through thy truth. Thy word is truth. As thou has sent me into the world. And who's the me? Yahweh Shah. And Yahweh Shah is what? It's the same John with Revelation. 
19 and 13, and he was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood, and his name is called the Word, the Word of God. See, so Yahweh Shah is the Word, and he's in Yahweh Shah, who's the Word, right? He said, what? Where is he at? This is St. John 17 and 18. As thou hast sent me into the world, even so have I also sent them into the world. He's in the world. So in order to, in order to pretty much um, get this truth, in order, you know, we, would, we had to go into the matrix because the truth was within the matrix. In order to get this truth, starting off, we had to go into the matrix, the world, you know, in order, you know, in, in, in order to stay on this truth, we have to go in, in and out of the world, hence, hence the matrix, because that's what the that's what the word has been sent into, because once you get it, we spread it, right, and we got to spread it to those that's in the world, because uh, for instances such as the brothers and sisters, you know, they're in the world. This is First Peter. First Peter. I'm thinking of. First Peter four. Actually, First Peter five, and I'm gonna start at eight. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, right? I'm going to jump down to the point. This verse 9, it says, Whom resist steadfast in the faith, knowing that the same afflictions are accomplished in your brethren that are in the world. See that? Knowing that the same afflictions are accomplished in your brethren that are in the world. And I'm going to actually read that same passage in the NLT. This is first Peter, first Peter five and eight in the NLT. Stay at uh, Slocky verse nine. Stand firm against him and be strong in your faith. Remember that your your Hamashiachim brothers and sisters all over the world are going going through the same kind of stuff you are. So pretty much all of us are in the world. You know, the brothers and sisters. That's why. That's why we have to uh, uh, stay. We we have to go pretty much go in the matrix in and out of the matrix what to be on this truth whether you teach it why because that's where the word was sent because the brothers and sisters is there you know and if you want to be fed you got to go in and out of the matrix in and out of the world you got to get on youtube you know and 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 you know or or go out link with brothers your congregation whatever but you gotta go into the world, to the matrix to do so. Cause that's where the hell we at. You know? That's where the truth is at. It's crazy. That's how it always been. And that's what makes it vexing. When you go to Second Peter 2 and 7, it says, And delivered just lot, vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. For that righteous man dwelling among them. So he represent like the word, the truth, the word, right? Because he had it. It says dwelling among them, right? The dumb and the dumb being the matrix. These people of the world. You want know, people of the world. Long as you're around people of the world, that's how you know you're in the matrix. The moment you're not amongst people that's of the world, you're not around them. You're not subject to being around them. You're no longer in the matrix. You came out. You know what I'm saying? Like if you will in a sense in a spiritual sense you know within the you know the confines of your home and since it's such as like such as that you're not exposed to you know these goddamn agents man you know these stumbling blocks all right these vipers these wolves the dangers you know so the devil will represent the world also because these people help make up the world Right, hence the matrix. It says, and seeing and hearing vex his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds. See? So I'm gonna, um, yeah, kind. So yeah, that's basically that. 
All right. Yeah, Khan. And I'm, I'm going to jump up to verse 2 is what I was looking for. It says, Many and many shall follow their promiscuous ways by reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. See that? And you jump back down to verse 7. And deliver just Lot. See that? I'm going to actually start at 6. And turn the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes. And condemn them with an overthrow, making them an ensample unto those that should live ungodly. Right? The world, these, this is a part of the matrix. You know? A people, you know, a group of people that helped make, 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 uh, make, help make, helped in the past times make up what's deemed, what's deemed the world. You know? Worldly. The matrix. Right? And they're back now spiritual Sodom in Egypt you know we're all you know which is where we at man so we amongst the place the Lord want to destroy because this place is being like the place that was destroyed as an end sample for those who was doing the things that that place was doing, which was not approved of the Heavenly Father, that would, you know, pretty much follow their footsteps like dummies and get the same destruction, you know? So we're amongst that right now. This place, you know, destructed Lord, you know, bring a massive judgment any anytime you're in the world because this, this this place is just consisted, consisted of or composed of all the things the Lord hates and going to destroy but anyway, read no, it says, make it dumb and sample unto those that after should live ungodly and deliver just lot vix with the filthy conversation of the wicked. For that righteous man dwelling among them and seeing and hearing vex his righteous soul from day to day with their unlawful deeds. See? So the way of truth. The way the uh the way of truth shall be spoken. Jumping back to two, and many shall follow their promiscuous ways by reason. Of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. So that's what they was talking about. They were speaking evil, uh, uh, evil of dignities and, and, and whatnot. You jump to verse 12 or 10. It says, but chiefly them that walk after the flesh and the, and the lust. That's who the Lord wants to destroy. That is, it says of the uncleanness, cleanness and despised government. Presumptuous are they self will. They are not afraid to speak evil of dignities. Exactly. And you jump to verse 12. It says, but these as natural brute beasts made to be. Let me read through 11. It says, whereas the angels, which are greater in power and might bring not really accusation against them before the Lord. Right. The same angels that was watching over Sodom and Gomorrah is watching this place. You know, it's the same conse consequence for the same action. And here we are amongst these people. That place got hit with fire and brimstone, man. You know? And we got to maneuver through a place that the angels that destroyed that place is watching today. You know? To be healed. To get our uh, daily bread. To get our armor. To, to You know, to spread the word. To be on the truth. You know? It's crazy. So it's dangerous, man. It says, the, but these as natural brute beasts made to be taken and destroyed. See that? And destroyed. Speak evil of things, of the things that they understand not. And shall utterly perish in their own corruptions. Alright? So that's exactly uh, what's, what's, the, what's the case. It says, and shall receive the reward of unrighteousness as they that counted pleasure to riot in the daytime. You know? This, this place goes up, man. You know, you amongst people that ride in the daytime. It says to, uh, it says spots they are and blemishes, right? So these people are like something that can be. If you got a white shirt on, they're 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 like, uh, you know, something that can stain your shirt. You know, easily. If you drink it the wrong way, you know, if you're if you're if you know you you mishandle it the wrong way, they can stain you. They can mess your outfit up. And how you out here looking crazy, they could piss you off, you know? How you thinking, man, I wish I never even, you know? It says, 
um, spots they are in blemishes sporting, sp sporting themselves with their own deceivings while they feast with you. See that? So, can't make that up, man. So you want some dangerous, some dangerous individuals, some dangerous people. All right. So this is a uh, Syrac, because that's what the world is. That's why the Lord said once again, I pray that thou keep it, take them not out the world, but keep them from what, from the evil. So this is uh, Syrac thirteen and thirteen. Observe and take good heed, for thou walkest in peril of thy overthrowing. When thou hearest these things, awake in thy sleep, and hear what? That the truth is in the matrix. And if you know the matrix, the, this movie, you know how dangerous it was. If you're hearing these scriptures, you're seeing what's going on, right? If you're just living life, you see how dangerous this world is, you know? And you have to be careful for that, those very reasons. Going back to Psalms 58 and uh, 7. Or uh, verse three, he shall send from heaven and save me from the reproach of him that will swallow me up. You see that? God shall send right, exactly. Which would be do what? Uh, how? How the Lord accomplish that? God shall send forth you. How about some shall shall send forth his mercy and truth to put you on game? You'll be illuminated first. You know, you get the you know shown what's you know the reality of the matter of the balance. This is reality. This is illusion. You know what I'm saying? It says, my soul is among is among lions. Why? Because where the Lord sent the truth is in the world. It's in the matrix. And in order to be on the truth, you got to go within the matrix. All right? So my soul is among lions. You now, now that's it. Exactly. Once you're in, the, you're in the world, you're amongst these people. You're on YouTube. You got to understand these things. As soon as you click it, it's just vexing. You know? The truth turned into some internet. Turned into some internet stuff. I want to do a lesson on that. You know, a lot of people in the uh, truth, they, 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 they look, you think they in the truth, but really they agents, they agent Smiths, you know, they can look like anybody, you know, and you would be deceived, you know, say many false prophets, let me grab that real quick, this is first, this is St. John, you know, is this, is this, is this the truth, man, this is, this is first John. chapter 4 and 1 beloved believe not every spirit but try the spirits whether they are of God because many false prophets are gone out into the world see that so you gotta be you gotta be mindful of that it's, 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 a, it's, it's a lot of fake false prophets it's a lot of agent smiths you know that, that can get you destroyed if you ain't paying attention you know men 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 uh, wolves wolves and Wolves and sheep's clothing. All right, let me grab that real quick. All right, this is uh, Salakia. Matthew seven. Matthew seven and fifteen, and it reads. Our Lord said, Beware of false prophets which come to you in sheep's clothing. See, in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ravening wolves. See that? So you got to pay attention to these dudes, dudes that's on the internet, you know, dudes that's in that internet spirit. It says, Ye shall know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes of thorns or figs of thistles? And you won't even know when you've been affected. But that's why you got to pay attention. You know? So you could just, you, they could look however, but they coming off like in a worldly way. So you, 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 you when you look, uh, when you get on YouTube, just get on YouTube and scroll. You know? If you subscribe to the pages or whatnot, you're going to see truth in the matrix clearly. You're going to see the matrix clearly and truth within it. Truth in it, man. You know, in the, in the world, the word, you know, this, this deceitfully being held, you know, by those that's not even prophets. That's not even really about this. You know, that's actually stumbling blocks. 
You got to beware. The Lord said, "Be what He said, beware of men. You know, beware. I send you amongst. You know, we grab that Matthew ten. All right, Matthew ten and sixteen. Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. So you got to know how to move. You got to be paying attention. These wolves is these these false prophets. These Asian Smiths." You know, turning the, the, the truth or the grace of our, of our Lord into lasciviousness, all these different things. These sisters, like the, the truth being sensationalized, all this, you know, that's not that's not what's supposed to go on. So you got to pay pay attention to that. Yep, this is first. This is Jude. You grab that. Jude. We're going to jump to the first verse. I mean, the fourth verse, Lockheed. Jude, verse 4. For there are certain men crept in unawares who were brought, who were before of old ordained to this combination. Because they're not really of the truth. You know? They don't really believe, so they damned already. You know, you come into the truth plan and never to take heed to it, you condemn. You know? It says. Who were before of old ordained to this condemnation. Ungodly men. Turning to grace. Right? The favor. The Lord did us a favor, man. Putting us on game. Illuminating us about this world. And, and constantly giving us daily uh, means to get through and make it unto the end. You know what I'm saying? But those same. You got individuals that what? They're turning the grace of our Lord into lasciviousness. And denying the only Lord. The only Lord. And our Lord, Yahushua HaMashiach. So pretty, pretty much dudes making it about something else. Dudes come in and they make it about something else. All right. Dudes pushing, they, they, they damn, you know. And you, you can be, you could become a victim of this. An example of this. And when you get that word lasciviousness, that word lasciviousness goes to excess or wantonness. All right. So just is 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 dudes doing too much, you know, making it about something it, it, it ain't, and that's when it becomes vexing, man, you know, because we're that's worldly. We're not of the world. All right. So going back to Psalms, I'm gonna go ahead and close out. This is Psalms 58 and 4. So my soul is among lions, and I even among and I lie. Even among them that are set on fire. See that? Even the sons of men, men that's, that's written to be destroyed, they're already condemned. In the spirit, they're already burning. You know, women, sisters, fake Christians, you know, whatever gender, you know, it says, even the sons of men whose teeth are spears and arrows and their tongue a sharp sword. So you got to be careful. These moms want to, uh, uh, they're, they're, you got to be careful. Their word it is as, as a canker, as the scriptures say. Like for those that ever got a, a, a canker sore, you know, when you go to uh, first, Second Timothy, I'll get that last one. Go ahead and close out. You know, obey the point. Close out. This is Second Timothy, chapter two and seventeen. It says, um, I'm actually start at sixteen. It says, but shun and profane and vain babylons. See that? For they will increase unto more ungodliness. So here it is. You trying to get your mind right, come out of the world, and you got dudes in the truth still being worldly, turning the truth into lasciviousness, the grace of our Lord, the favor of our Lord and, and into lasciviousness. And what's the grace of our Lord really? Ultimately, it's just this truth. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, it's the, the, the you know, the favor the favor, the favor consists of all things that the Lord done a favor on us for. Like, you know, uh, the, the way to be acquitted, to get the new covenant, you know, uh, which, you you know, we already got, you know, we're not in, under, you know, but we're transitioning to, you know, and dudes turning it into something else, man. You trying to, you know, be washed, make you clean and, and, and. You know, 
They promoting something else. While you already got to go amongst the world to get to the truth, the actual truth. You got dudes pretending like it's something else that it ain't. So anyway, so that's why you want to pay attention. And that's, and that's done through, you know, their words. It says, but shun profane and vain babblings for they will increase. For they will increase unto more ungodliness and their word do and their word will eat as do a canker. Like and that goes into gang green. It says of whom is Hymenius and, and Philetus who concerning the truth have erred saying that the resurrection is past already and have overthrown the faith of some. So you got to be careful. You among you subjecting yourself or amongst individuals that could take you out of the faith, out of your beliefs. You know, so you got to fall back. You got to know how to move. So closing out Psalms 58 and 4, my soul is among lions and I lie even among them that are set on fire, that are set on fire. Even the sons of men whose teeth are spears and arrows and their tongue a sharp sword. Be thou exalted, O God, above the heavens and let thy glory be above all the earth. Cause we ready, we want to get the hell out of here, man. We don't even want to be amongst this crap anymore. You know, we're gonna end up in the sky eventually on those ships. Let like take this. We trying to get out of this. You want that's the spirit you want to be in. You want you trying. We trying to get out of this place, not out of America, out of this whole world. We need a new earth. We look for new heavens and a new earth, man. A country, continent, a new state. That shit is not good enough, man. We want out, and you see why. But we got to do what we got to do, because why? The truth is in the matrix, a.k.a. what? The world. All right. So, yeah, that's pretty much the point. Um. Yeah. So with that, call on like how about you how shy or how You've been warm, man. Look out. So long.